everyone and welcome back to a Civilization 5 game. Don't adjust your eyes. Uh, it's it's actually a thing that's happening. Spiff. Hello. Duncan. Hello. Rithian. Hello. This is our new resolution. It's to return to Civ 5. Um, we decided <laughs> it's the better game. We're doing a test game. This is going to be a test game. Uh, we're running it on a LAN. We're using Lek mod because it has an auto uh, pause thing, so we can have lunch later. Uh, I'm playing as Bulgaria because their logo looks a bit like the Yogscast logo, which I think is quite funny. It's got it's got that why. Um, also, they have a cool thing which is get uh, science from writers. I feel like being a writer today. I don't know about you guys. Um, Spiff. Hello. Uh, who are you playing as? I'm playing as uh, Mexico. Yes. I, I thought that Mexico would be good fun. They do some things with like city states whereby, um, you know, you can be friends with them easier. And I thought that would be a good idea because I've never messed with city states before. Oh, mm. that's not so far. They're, they're, so this is a small map on the Hellblazer map pack. Uh, so it's actually got a lot of city states. I didn't tell you that in advance. Um, okay. Okay. But, right. But that I had could, no be, idea could be good that. for you. Uh, Rithian, who are you playing? I'm playing as New Zealand. Uh, Michael Joseph Savage. So oh, I'm playing New Zealand. Um, more like yeah. Snoo Zealand. Ah. <laughs> oh, get him. So, so there is a uh, Maori sieve as well, which is different. Yes. Maori Maori sieve. Um, yeah. Well, that's interesting. Got a little bit of an interesting Petra start here on the desert hills, so I'm probably going to beeline for that. Uh, oh, it's all coming back. It's all coming mm -hmm. back. Duncan, you're here as well. What are you playing? I am ghoul. A ghoul. I'm a ghoul. A ghoul from World Orca. What child? Dead stories. <laughs> a, a ghoul. I'm a ghoul. Uh, I'm excited. What 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 a ghoul do? Do you remember? Do you have any idea? They get a free uh, great general. They have better swordsmen and they have better walls. Oh, oh. that's nice. Hype. That does sound nice. Uh, well, let's let, let's the game begin. So start off. Pick your starting tech. Uh, if you want to get horses near you because you don't have any production in your spawn, you might probably want to pick animal husbandry. Uh, if you want to get iron near you, mining is iron is unlocked from immediately. A lot of Reef. stuff has changed. Mining iron revealed immediately. Very strange. That's not normal, is it? You don't. Do you start iron with mining as a tech. You you must have started with it as a tech or got it from a goody hut because. Oh no I no no! I mean, if mining. you go, if you pick iron, if you pick mining. Oh it yeah, you get iron. yeah. It reveals it straight away. It used away. to be You're not right. revealed till iron working. So I guess that's to let you plan more carefully. Mm. Yeah, um, I think I prefer that. That that seems a lot better. I like that. Yeah, uh, but I've started with th three incense. Um, apparently, Bulgaria smells great. I got three silver. Oh, and I got a free tech. Nice. Oh my gosh. Lucky you. Oh my gosh. I got gosh. my my warrior just turned into a spearman. <laughs> they found an ancient hut and they had sticks in it and they took their axes and put them on the end of the sticks and now oh. they're longer. That's a that's a great advantage. High quality sticks. Yes. I'm a bit concerned about this turn timer. It's, a, it's quicker than I thought it would be. Well, if you remember correctly with like mod, it increases with the more cities we place down. So it's going to be it's going to be super fast at the start, and then it will slow down nicely, hopefully. Okay. Um, well, so yeah, of course, worry. we're already on turn three. It's all happening. I'm actually <laughs> going to build. I think I'm just going to straight up build my unique granary, Ooh. Um, because I can. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's an icon of a cow. It's a cam bar, and I know that's an unusual turn two move, but I did second second build move. But I didn't know whether I wanted a worker or a settler because I'm not sure if I can actually build anything oh, with a so worker. So many Hi, Riffy and I. I Riffy and, and I have immediately movie. found each other. Um, we are we are quite close. <laughs> 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 it's about a space for one city between our two capitals, which I think. Ooh, you know we can be fun. friends, Riffy, and we can be good friends. I imagine. I think we'll have to yeah. be, yes. Yes. We'll have to be. Mandatory what? friendship. Let's go. Yes. <laughs> forced forced friendship. So this is the this is that early game where you, you're looking for your first uh expand spot. Uh you're yeah. maybe I looking found a for, couple of nice ones. Looking to negotiate with your, your friends. Uh for, for where you're gonna I found someone as well. Who's this down here? Who's the the, the brown border? Uh, I'd imagine that would be Duncan, right? I'm green. Oh, Maybe I'm, you're colorblind. I'm, I'm um, green and white. Yeah. So I'm I really will say green. I've I've one really interesting thing about my sieve, which is that my settler unit doesn't 
uh, stop the city growing when it is produced. Oh, yeah. The only downside oh. is it doesn't. It isn't produced based off of food. It's entirely production, which means that it's a slower settler to build, right. but the city still grows whilst I'm building it. Oh, that's actually really cool. Yeah, it's a. It's made this build very strange. Um, oh, I've I've met Spiff. He's found hello Mount Uluru. Yes, I have. Yeah, Mount Uluru is like two tiles away from my capital. I kind of wish yeah. I placed oh. it near it already, but... Two know. tiles is pretty good anyway. You're going to grow like into two that. Two tiles is a bit of an ex- exaggeration. Uh, two tiles five, is an exaggeration. Five <laughs> I but can yeah. take... He is lying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> five or four. Close enough for two, right? Let's be honest, yeah. Granary done. Ah, uh, good old tradition. Oh, yeah. It's been a while. Oh, I haven't got to pick mine yet. Is that what you're picking? So, of course, yeah. yes. The the wonderful thing about Civ is um, policy trees. Is the policy trees? Yeah. Mm. Oh god! It wow, is these so turds fun. are rocketing by. They are a <laughs> by, yeah. Mexico City four pop. Got some worker heading out there. Oh, I could take him, Spiff. I could take the worker. Look. Oh, this one just spawned in, so he's brand new. He's a he's a fresh fresh little baby in the wide world. Um, I'm not gonna kill him. Don't worry. That's I'm not, I'm, not, nice. I'm not like that. I'm I appreciate not. this wonderful sign of friendship that you've granted me. That's very Yeah, generous. this is like, it's turn nine. I feel like <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we've got a, a while to go playing this, and it's going to get... We're, we're expecting... We are on, on online speed, which is a new thing added to Civ Five. Yeah, uh, by or to, via this mod, yeah. So that will speed this game up, because normally when we play this, it's like eight or nine hours, um, or it used to be. Yeah. See, see, it's all flooding back. Um, flooding well, it's, back. It's not all flooding hmm. back, but some of it is flooding back. Is it flooding or is it leaking? Right. Now, do I... Okay, first of all, yeah. Do you want tradition for a small, tight empire? Do you want liberty for a large, sprawling empire, but a free worker and a free settler? Or do I want honor for military? Or do I want piety for faith? Hmm. I've, I've gone um, liberty because I just I I think it's it's just such a good thing. I like the uh, I like the early golden age is nice. The whole settler building thing is good. Although I don't know if the settler thing actually affects my sieve because my sieve doesn't have the settler unit. Uh, it still ah. feels nice. Uh, it'll be okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you'll be you'll manage. I'll manage. Uh, I'll f- it'll like probably it. it'll probably work with it in some way or another. Yeah, I'm gonna go tradition. I'm gonna be traditional. You I did strike honor. me as a traditionalist, Lewis, yeah. Oh, honour. Oh, dear. And I'm going to go to five pop before I build my first settler. That's my initial plan. I've been building my first settler for like seven turns, and he's not ready yet. I've made two workers. <laughs> two workers? What? Wow, you've got a lot of land to improve. Jeez. I mean, there are a lot of luxuries around. I will give you well, that. Remember, you, they last forever now, and they, can, yeah. they take a while to build. Yeah, they're not builders anymore. They're oh, workers. yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's the crazy thing with Civ, where it's like, you know, the workers actually, you know, they do their work and then they move on. Whereas yeah. this is like forever work, um, the worst kind <laughs> of existence. <laughs> okay, settler. I know, I think I'd rather be building farms than, than warring as like a soldier. Probably. True. So there's some really interesting resources out. I've got olives. Uh, I saw a bit of rubber over here, which is, looks like a tyre. Very interesting. I've got some obsidian um, for some reason. Sames. Yeah. You yeah. can make nether portals with that. There's oh, jade as well. Hardwood. Hardwood. Yeah. Uh, let's go and make friends with all these city states. Oh, here's Uluru. Okay. Uluru. Everyone is so close. Oh my god. <laughs> so um Lewis I could... classically like found the tiniest, tiniest of map and decided to make a make it on it. Well, this was a six-player map, right? Six-player. Riffin, I have my settler out, and I could forward settle you into that corner, but I'm going to not do Please that don't. because that would be a dick move, as you appear to be stuck in your peninsula. A little um, bit. Yeah. So good, I will kind of be you. friendly, very friendly. Where are you going to settle instead? I'm going to settle on the old faithful natural wonder instead of <laughs> the Uluru natural wonder. <laughs> right. You're going to go for the like. There's two natural ones. Should we all just have one? Because I've got the Fountain of Youth up here. <laughs> Oh, I saw. I found that as well. Oh, that yeah. might be between me and you then. It is, yeah. Well, so you're all having one except me. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> well, you might not have looked your other might side. Be around there somewhere. <laughs> yeah, maybe you've got one just tucked away. You, you never know. <laughs> 
I only just discovered iron because I got mining. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you get mining, you just it's nice because you can make an early production center, I guess. You know. Mm. You, can, you can go straight into the old um build a mine, get get like production going. Which is obviously important. Oh my gosh, I remember citizen management. Yeah, this is this is the one where your cities can defend themselves right out the gate. Um, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's very nice. Very, very nice. Good. Mexico City will stand tall against the barbarian incursions. Yes. God, there's barbs everywhere, actually, over here. Yeah. So they if you've get, spotted them. They like to spawn. This uh, this fountain of use is right next to two city states. <laughs> yeah, that, there's a lot of city of states them. on the map. So, I, yeah, I, like I said, I put 12 city states on, but it's only a, a small map. We well, might I like have the city states. <laughs> this is going to make it interesting to place our own stuff, Lewis. Well, I think they they work well. I picked on like... as an so I can take some out. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, there's there's going to be definitely more than enough to kill. Um, yeah, we're going to run out of city state. Well, yeah, we're not going to run out of them. There, there's a lot. That's good. Oh, we're doing it. We're building improvements. I'm I'm quite happy with my start. I've got a copper, which gives happiness. I've got iron. Um, I'm going to yeah, build a iron, one turn. Silver, olives. Deer camp. I got a bison camp. Yeah, I got a bit of everything. Got a horse, mm, bananas. I'm excited to improve all of this land, and also I'm really excited to get Petra. Just to Ooh, let you know, you're gonna try Petra. Can you guys not Petra. get Petra? That would be appreciated. I could not get Petra. Yeah, <laughs> I don't need it. It'd just be nice if you did. <laughs> Who's this know. Bulgarian warrior? That's me. Hello. <laughs> That's me. That's me. Yeah, I'm me. I'm him. Oh, I'm oh he me. mentioned me. Me. <laughs> you sound very excited, Lewis, to be included. <laughs> I am very excited. All right. I think I'm going to settle here. I'm going to settle here. And I'm going to settle here. So I'm going to settle in three locations near to me. And then I'll be, that'll be it, right? Tradition. You know, the four city oh, yeah. tradition. Yeah, that's a classic traditional play. Oh, Pantheon. Time to pick. Oh. How much time do I have? A minute. Okay, that's fine. Oh my god, who's attacking port au Prince? Are they getting shredded by uh, barbs. By barbs. Wow. Good grief. One of the city states might be dead already, guys. <laughs> Duncan, oh, you've got to up your game. The city states well, are uh, falling. I mean, <laughs> what? They're not going to last long without you want, murdering them first. Here. I'll, I'll, I'll do it. I don't. I just got to pick which ones I want to kill and which ones I want to be friends with. Uh, I think you can, you can, in the wise words of um, Starship Troopers, you got to kill them all. Um. <laughs> <laughs> now, where's Petra? Up here. Currency. I'm just going to beeline there. Just to let you know my strat, guys. <laughs> I don't want to miss enough, out on enough. Petra. Now, of course, that means I'm not going for the Great Library. Um, I forgot about the Great Library. I am Jesus, going for the Great Library. Four uh, turns away. Tech. Wow. <laughs> You're not doing a great library. Uh, yeah, free free turns oh. from my great library. Okay, Here are you, you actually four turns away though? Or I am, I am actually you lying about four turns away. I will I will take a picture of this and send it to the WhatsApp group, guys. I'm just saying because uh, I'm I am, nine turns away, so maybe I'm definitely I'm Oh no, turns, you're not. Turns. Oh no. There you go. Let me take a picture of my capital. I mean I I um <laughs> I shouldn't really have gone for it, but it popped up, and I'm like, <laughs> "What if no one else is?" Oh, you, you guys! Yeah. It's right. so. The thing is, it all comes flooding back. Yeah, it really does. This, yeah, this Civ Five like knowledge, right? There you go. Yeah. I've sent proof to the group chat. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I, I am free turns with the Great Library. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I, I'm uh, I'm cancelling. <laughs> I'm cancelling. There you go. I saved you that time, Riffian, okay? Plus, That's I think fact, you get yeah. some gold because you sunk I do some get production yeah. into it. I feel like I've got a pretty banging start here. Pretty pleased. Um, Mine's pretty nice too, I feel. Yeah, I feel like, in terms of map, this is an incredibly like tight, kind of friendly-ish location. I, I think we... Yeah, there's a lot of there's kind of just enough space um, to get everything done. I think like I've got three cities. Ideally, I'd want like five, but three will do nicely. Oh crap! 
All right, if I got calendar, can I actually build on this? Oh, we right. love the king day. Oh, <laughs> it's my favorite day. We love yeah. Riffian day. Mainly because I'm the king. It's great. Yeah. yeah. You can. Can I just buy this tile and will that give me the money from the barb camp? Let's see. Uh, got rid of it. I don't think I got anything from it. Oh, that's a shame. Well, maybe that's on purpose. I, I think you don't get money from uh, the expanding into a barb camp, but you do kill it. Uh, you do, however, get goody hut bonuses if you expand into a goody hut. Good. Okay. Goody hut. That's good to know. Thank you, Spiff. Thank All you for good. The, the tips. At the very least, uh, that's how it works in base Sif. Who the fuck knows in wacky Sif? Yeah. <laughs> got an escorted settler making its way out. Out of town. Get out of town. I think I might settle on this hill here. Because my cities are going to be big, right? I'm going to have four big cities. I'm not going to, like... Um, I don't want to have them too tight, too close. You know, this city's... Actually, this city's already got a lot of tiles to work. Hmm. I might have to kill a couple of city states to give me some more, mm -mm. more breathing room. You're but going to be killing city states already. Already. Want... Already. Already. The city now, states. Now, of course, friend. the main the main restriction of expanding is happiness, right? I seem to remember every yep. city you build is like a neg negative three happiness penalty. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, that that you may look be for is, those like, luxury resources. Yeah, great library has been built. Thank Spiff. you, there thank you, is. thank you. We heard the honk sound of the great library being built. Honk, 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 honk. Wow. The sad noise of a man failing to build a wonder. <laughs> uh, sad honks, sad honks indeed. Uh, now, the question is, which free tech do I get? Normally, it's the whole drama and poetry, but I actually have the opportunity to grab philosophy, which is what I'm going to do. That's a good do. one. That's a yeah. good one. I'm going to grab that philosophy. Uh, and then I think that's a solid to... pick, right? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I feel like it's probably the best I could go for. Now, one thing you have to remember in this game is that <clears throat> your national wonders, I mean, you have to, you don't want to build a city at the wrong time and not be able to get your national college out. Yeah. Yeah. Really that's always the annoying national college trick oh it's, it's this I, i'm in a really awkward spot for my third city because i can't go south because uh, there's no land border so i kind of have to settle um north ish close towards duncan and port au prince which is an awkward spot to be in <laughs> very awkward. i have a city i have a city on that river already oh what on the river the port au prince is running yeah. Oh my god, oh there is god. so much stuff here. I'm just gonna so have many to probably pantheons. Boat Which a pantheon settler away. Want? I want the one with incense. Uh this one? Incense. Goddess of the Fields. Oh, I have so that gives me plus one culture and faith on coffee, incense, tea, and coffee. What is it? What coffee, incense, tea, and coffee. Cotton. So wow. cotton, incense, <laughs> tea, and coffee. So I've got cotton here, which I'll build on, and I've got three incense. So that's four faith. I'll take Change. it. I found the edge of my island. All right, you can heal up, sir. And you found you the edge up. of your islands. Yeah. I found it. So I know I know exactly how much space I have to expand. It's not a lot. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm, it actually costs four money to make a new um, city. Uh, for, for, hap for, for happiness, for happiness. happiness to make when you make a new city. Yeah, I'm at minus Jeez. two now. Shit. That's going to be rough. I'm going to go down what does, quite. What a lot. does that do? Just stops all growth. Uh, no, it it uh, massively hurts growth, uh, yeah. which is the big one. It's like seventy five percent reduced growth, but then um, it's like the two percent per unhappiness reduced gold and food. I think. Yeah, okay. it is. It is. I remember really luxury rough. trading it's being is a much bigger thing in this game than it was. Oh in yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Oh yeah, I mean it's they good in Sim Six too, but we never really bother. But in this one, you have to basically. It just means less in Six though, because you you need yeah. like luxuries just aren't like as important in Six. I don't think. Yeah. Because they don't no. do everything that you want them to do. Like they don't improve your whole empire. It's just like one one yeah. to four. Cities. This is just the global happiness. Just yeah. getting one trade. So bam, four more on all of it is huge. You know. Oh my god, <laughs> I haven't got quarries. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> quarries quarries are not immediate. They're under masonry. They I are, guess that's yes. because they unlock a luxury quarries, whereas oh no, the others are not luxuries too. Okay, we're just gonna carry on with our strat. Petra. 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 So what's the other Bulgaria thing that I have? Um so Bulgaria's interesting, right? Uh Bulgaria, Yorkscast logo, of course. Mm. I get uh, the, the better granary. I get the Konitsa. Swarm Stonehenge. Oh, a, did you a, not a grab that knight, A knight. No, no, no. I was looking at it, but I was like, I'm not going to sit here and try to build more wonders. <laughs> That's gonna, I'm going to lose out Stonehenge? of so much infrastructure. I got That'd Stonehenge. Be Duncan. It's yeah. that six faith a turn so I can get a fucking. Really and stuff. Yeah. yeah. Wow. I'm surprised. I really thought that would be a, a guaranteed Riffian's take. That is spicy. Spicy, spicy. spicy. Oh. Holy crap. Well, there you go. That, that is not spicy. What anyone expected. It's only, it only took me six turns. Yeah, yeah, I think it was eight turns for mine a hundred while ago, but I was like, nah. I'm, I need to get some infrastructure in my cities. I can't just sit here. I'm trying to get wonders. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> Okay, I'm, 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 I bought, I bought an archer for money. Wow. I remember Sending money is usually to, to, more challenging to secure in this my boat. Yeah. next city location. Uh, yeah, I've got three cities down, no, oh no, two cities down and one planned. And then when I get the settler, I will go and settle there. And then I need some happiness. Then I need some roads. Look then I need big some nerd. buildings. Oh yeah, planning roads. stuff. You gotta build roads. Oh god, um, connecting all of the cities, no! <laughs> you could just auto-road to somewhere though, remember? Yes, that is true. Yeah. Oh, do I want a coastal city though here? Mm, that looks dangerous. No, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make any coastal cities. I'm just gonna hope that no one yeah. votes me. There is a there is New Zealand in the game, which I think is yeah. Riffin, and I think he yeah. did settle coastliners on his I, I I hesitated for 30 seconds before I placed it. But yeah, I did end up making it coastal. We will see if I end up regretting that or not. But uh, yeah. I, I don't think you will. I think you're in a prime spot for it. It's a very, It was a very good spot, which is why I did it. But yeah. So I pick us my Pantheon. Yeah, this one's really rough because there's like a bajillion options for Pantheon. And there isn't really a wrong answer. The, the way I usually do it is what like terrain tile to have the most of. So if I have the most camps or the most plantations or the most pastures, then that's just the one I go for. Go for barracks. You've gone plus two production for barracks, okay. Hmm. <laughs> that's, yeah. That could be Oh, good. the that camps one are really gone. Good. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, camps is, camps is just plus one food, uh, not yeah. production. I don't want to jinx anything, guys, but I just want to say it's working. <laughs> Don't no, say that's it. a jinx right there. Now, I wanted to tell you something about interesting about this. So I found out that by default, the way Civ 5 saves games is if you want to make a save game, okay, the game doesn't make a save game. It copies the latest auto save file and renames it. Okay. Huh. Um, wow. Which apparently leads to a lot of problems. Who could have foreseen that? <laughs> wow. Yeah. Thanks, mm -hmm. Sid. <laughs> And, and so that's that's literally how it's set up, which is astonishing, really. Um, but yeah, that's 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 a little bit of interesting trivia about about the game that you guys didn't know, and you now, True. You now know. That's a great episode of Civ True for this week. So <laughs> apparently, if you if you save the file and then you save it again, overwrite it, it does save it as a proper save. And apparently, this is a problem a lot of games have is that. They reload the autosave, but the autosave is fucked. Or they try and manually save okay. it and it's fucked. Right. So apparently this thing makes a... I've got a mod on which makes a man... I've already got a mod on my computer, not on any of yours, but it makes a manual uh, save on the computer and that huh. um, right. apparently f allows you to re-host. So if we do get a sync, a desync, we will just re-host. Okay. That's the current meta. Okay. okay. That is the current actually... meta to wrangle the technology <laughs> to work <in. laughs> Yeah, it is It is wild. Like, the reason we haven't played this game in ages is not because we prefer Civ VI. Uh, it's yeah. simply because this didn't work. Didn't work. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> like, I don't know what to tell you, but the devs fucked the game. <laughs> yeah, we, we we tried. It kept crashing, you know, <laughs> and desyncing, so... Yeah. So this, this is the goal. We are trying... This year, 
Is it the year of Civ 5? Question mark. This but is we'll the see. Year of Civ 5. Yeah, 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 for sure. That'd be good fun.